A plan to have the Glendale Police Department take over policing in neighboring Warson Woods is slowed after pushback from some residents. Power of Two's Chris Renier live in Warson Woods for us with what we're learning about this this morning. Good morning, Chris. Marjorie, good morning to you. Our post-dispatch partners report that this entire outsourcing plan will be studied further before any final action is taken. We are just outside the Warson Woods Police Department here right off Manchester Road. The Post reports during a Warson Woods Board of Aldermen meeting last night, city leaders announced that a citizens committee will be formed to study the idea of contracting police services with Glendale. That development follows a town hall meeting a week ago where some Warson Woods residents were critical of the outsourcing proposal. We understand residents voiced opposition at the Board of Aldermen meeting last night as well. Some are concerned that police patrols and services in Warson Woods will suffer if Glendale police take over policing here. But supporters say the plan would save Warson Woods nearly $2 million over 10 years and that the savings could be used for other projects. Under the proposal, the Glendale Police Department would hire the five existing rank and file officers from the Warson Woods PD, and the Warson Woods Police Chief would have a new role in city government. Warson Woods Mayor Larry Howe says most officers would get raises and better benefits. Warson Woods and Glendale already share fire department, EMS, and court administration services. It is unclear when anything final might take place. For now, live in Warson Woods, I'm Chris Renier.